what an awesome day for a pool party. It's way too hot for dancing. Plus, I might spill my cool coconut drink. Oh no, I'm all out of juice. Waiter! Yes, so? Hey dude, can I get another one of these cool coconut drinks? Of course, sir. I'll be right back. That little rascal thinks he can bust me around, does he? Well, let's see if he likes his drink with a little drop of my Motion Madness Potion. Mwahaha! Here you go, sir. Thanks, dude. It's so hot outside, and I'm super thirsty. Ah, oh, that's better. <laughs> ah, what's wrong, Ben? Out of control? Ah, what are you doing here, you party pooper? Oh, but the party is just getting started. Wanna dance, Ben? Make it stop! Ah! Whoa, that's one terrifying tango. Ah! No! Ah! 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 You've really made a big splash at this party, Ben. Hmm, refreshing. I think the poor must have made that potion Dr. Animo gave me wear off. Maybe he'd like to swim too. It's hero time! Hey, Dr. Animo, wanna have a go on the slip and slide? Ooh, ah, ooh, ah! These are some smooth moves, Dr. Animo. You have to teach them to me. Ah, what's that one called? The disco dock? Ooh, ooh! Ah! And the winner of the dance competition is the crazy dancing disco doctor over there. You did it anyway. Your disco moves won first prize. <sighs> ah! Ah! Oh, nothing like a nice jog to keep me in shape. Let's see if I can go around the world. I bet I can do one lap in less than five minutes. Three, two, one, go! Yeehaw! Whoa, someone really likes sandcastles. Oh, what a big climbing frame. Hey, who put a big hole in my racetrack? Whoa, whoa, what a trip. One lap around the world in four and a half minutes. Easy peasy. I need something harder. Hey, I know. I could do it backwards. Ha, this is too easy. Oof. Ouch. Oh. Sacre bleu. Oh, sorry. Hey. Who turned out the lights? <laughs> ah, a mummy! Finally, some peace and quiet away from the troublemaker Ben 10. Ah, I sure love tinkering with my machines. Ooh, whoops, this isn't right. I must have made a wrong turn somewhere. Stop, what are you doing, you clumsy fool? You're destroying all my precious gizmos. Where on earth am I? There must be a way out somewhere. Yes, it's the door. Why don't you use it and go mess up someone else's things? You won't get away with this, you crazy kid. I'm going to invent some backwards robots that chase you away for good. Okay, that was a bit trickier than I thought it would be, but it was still pretty fast. 
Six minutes? I bet even Steam Smythe could have been faster than that. It's got to be around here somewhere. Hmm, I should really tidy up a bit. Hmm. 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 I've looked high and low. Where could it be? Aha, maybe I haven't looked high enough. Gotcha. Mission accomplished. Man, I'd probably lose the Omnitrix if it wasn't attached to my wrist. I really need to get organised. That's it. It's hero time. Did anyone call for some super duper stinky glue? There. Hmm, I wonder if this stuff works on other things. Haha, -ha, this is awesome. Now let's try something really big. Sweet, free parking forever. Well, 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 what we have here. I thought I smelled something disgusting. Hey, I don't smell. <laughs> well, I've smelled worse. Ha, enough silly talk. I'm gonna squash and squish you like the bug you are. You're gonna need a pretty big fly swatter if you wanna take me down, Dr. Inmo. True, you are bigger than most cockroaches. Luckily, I've got some of my super special bug spray that will shrink you down to the size of a wiggly worm. Oh, yuck, this stuff smells worse than the skunk's armpit. Wow, now you're in a sticky situation, Dr. Animo. Huh? I guess my goo is more stinky than sticky. I wonder how long before it wears off of everything else. Oh, I guess not that long at all. Oh, get me out from under here. Where's that noise coming from? Oh well, I'm sure it's nothing. See you later. I heard that Hex keeps his stuff in a secret temple somewhere in this stinky old jungle. Oh man, it smells worse than Stinkfly's armpits in here. We'd better find the temple soon. Oh, finally! This must be the place. It looks as old as Hex. Hux's Forbidden Temple. Keep out. Wow, Hex is dumber than a horde of zombies. Boy, Hex is going to be so mad when he realises that none other than me, Ben Tennyson, the coolest hero in the world, has stolen his precious staff. Huh. Who leaves something like that just lying around? <laughs> oh, Ben, you must think you're so clever finding my secret forbidden temple. Do you really think I'll be so stupid enough to keep my stuff in this crumbly cave? You're not a superhero, you're a super loser. Big mistake, Hex. I'm gonna teach you a lesson that you will never forget. Ha! Huh. Looking for this? Oh no! This one must be fake! You must be so crushed! <laughs> oh! Wait, it's a good thing that diamonds are tougher than stone. It's hero time! You have to do better than that, Hex. I'm made of harder stuff. Ooh! Ah. <sighs> Ooh! Oh no, the Omnitrix has timed out. I'd better get out of here before I'm buried alive. Not so fast, you. <laughs> What's the rush? I thought you wanted to stay and teach me a lesson. Looks like I'm going to have to fight him after all. I'd better use the transformation chamber. 
It's hero time! Who <laughs> blow? God, you did block him. You're not getting out of here so easy. Let's see if that pile of junk you drive around can deal with my magic. Hey, Het, you ready for your lesson? Whoa! Got yourself in a bit of a tangle, eh, Het? See you later. I'll get you next time, you little brat. Mark my words. Oh, man. We were so close to catching Steam Smythe, and then the rust bucket broke down. He could be anywhere by now. Oh, I better get it working again before I melt. It's so hot. Hmm. Not here. Nope. Where on earth did I put my tools? Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Oh. No tools? No tools! How am I going to fix the rust bucket without my tools? They must be around here somewhere. I'm sure I packed them. <gasps> the rust bucket. Oh, this is hopeless. Aha! Got you, you, you little slimy little toad. You think you can follow me to my secret hideout without me noticing, eh? Hey, who are you calling a toad? Oh, did I hurt your little feelings? What are you going to do about it? You're going to regret that. It's hero time! Uh-oh. Who's the little one now? Next time, pick on someone your own size. Wait, wait. Uh, um, I think there's been a misunderstanding. Whoa, I'm getting dizzy. You're getting dizzy. Oh, thank you, thank you. I'll promise I'll be good. Just please no more spinning. You're right. You're way too heavy for that. Maybe I should work out a little more first. Hey, put me down. I'm not some sort of tool for your exercise routine. Smythe, you're a genius. Um, I am? You might not be good for working out, but you're exactly what I need to fix the rust bucket. What? A little screwing here. Yeah! A couple of hammers here. Ow, ow, ow. A bit of sawing here. E, F, E, F. Hmm. All looks a bit dirty now. I think my rust bucket needs a good polish. Polish? This thing's a pile of junk. Well, with your help it won't be. Thanks, my thee boy. I couldn't have done it without you. Wow, good as new. All I needed was the right tool for the job. I'll get you next time, you little brat. Mark my words. Ah, oh, this is the life. The sea, the sand, the sun. Ben. Tennyson, dude, you really deserve some time off. I'm just going to kick back, do some sunbathing. Nothing but me, the rust bucket, and the sound of the waves. Caca, caca, squeak, squeak, caca, squeak. Hey, get out of here, you stupid sea chicken. Can't you see I'm trying to relax here? Oh, that's better. Finally, peace at last. Oh, what was that? Do you even know what you're doing? How dare you? I'm a legendary machine builder. I got the mind of a pure evil genius. Yeah, well, don't quit your day job. This is my day job, you ghoul. You'll see, once that tuna tank is complete, that little pain, Ben Tennyson, will regret even messing with us. A tuna tank? Well, that sounds fishy to me. I think it's time to give Hex and Steam Smythe a tan they'll never forget. It's hero time! You? What are you doing here? Funny, I was just about to ask you the same thing. 
You guys enjoying the sun? Well, how about some extra heat? Whoa there, I think you need to cool off a bit. There, let's hang you up to dry. Whoa! Oh, too bad for you. And look, this rusty old thing has all sorts of parts and gizmos I could use to make my tuna tank even better. You don't mind if I borrow a few things, would you? Hey, get off there, you terrible teapot. Stop messing with my rust bucket. Oh, don't you worry. I'll be sure to leave this pile of junk in one piece. It's just that the rest of the pieces will be attached to my tuna tank of destruction. Awesome, I think I'm starting to dry off. If I can just keep these idiots distracted for a bit longer, I can change back into heat blast and teach them a lesson. Hey, Hex! Well, well, well. I've never thought I'd see you taking orders from smelly old Smythe. How dare you? I don't need this big buffoon to help. I could fight you all by myself. Buffoon? You can't even fight your way out of bed in the morning. Ha! My magic is way more powerful than any of your silly contraptions. I could send you sailing far, far away just by waving my staff. Oh, how romantic. So it's a fist fight you want? I'll punch you so hard on your skeleton skull, your shoes will fall off. Oh, wait, I forgot. You don't have any shoes, do you? But ha 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 ha. Well, it's been great hanging around listening to you two losers, but I'm supposed to be on holiday. It's hero time! Quick, throw more water on him. You throw more water on him. Wow, this has turned into a great beach party, guys. But it's not a real party without dancing. Careful, guys. Too much dancing in the sun can make you real tired. Ooh. Ooh. Glad you decided to get out the sun. Wouldn't want you to get sunburnt. Ah. Oh. You're gonna have to run faster than that, slow coat smile. Mark my words. As soon as I get my hands on you, you'll regret messing with me. Gotta catch me first, Snail Smythe. Grandpa. Gwen, where are you guys? You better not have gone and got ice cream without me. That's just not fair. Grandpa. Gwen. Grandpa must have locked the doors. I can't get in. You can run, but you can't hide. Cornered like a teeny tiny mouse. Hmm, not quite tiny enough, but I know someone who is. It's hero time! Bless you, little bug. Oh well, you're trapped in there with nowhere to go. I'll just wait out here. You'll have to come out sooner or later. Oh no, if Grandpa and Gwen come back with stinky old Smythe around, there's going to be trouble. Let's see what the rust bucket can do. back here and fight me like a man. But I'm not a man. I'm a mouse, just like you said. A mouse with a cannon. E F Z Ah, oh, come on, Steam Smythe. Let's play catch. Ah! Out! Out! Ah! Out! Ah! That rust bucket is more like a tank than a rusty bucket. Run away! Run away! Ah! 
better luck next time. Well, that was fun. Well, what should I do now? It's too bad that Grandpa and Gwen went off to have fun without me. What am I talking about? I've got the rust bucket all to myself. I'm going to have one of my famous Ben 10 Bonanzas. Party! Boop, 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 yeah, yeah. Ben, we're back. We brought you ice cream. What on earth happened to my campsite? Uh oh. Uh, I think I'll go see what Steam Smythe is up to. Oh man, this pizza is so good. I don't know if I can fit any more of this awesome cheesiness in my stomach. Okay, maybe just one more slice. It's just so tasty. Mm. Six slices? That's my new record! So sorry to interrupt you stuffing your face, but I was just passing and noticed this awesome food festival. Now why did no one invite me? I didn't think a dusty old skeleton like you needed to eat. Oh, I didn't come here to eat, but I know things that are dying to eat you. Let's see if you can handle my pizza monsters. Hey, where are all my pizza gone? Oh man, I'm so stuffed. There's no way I can fight off all of these evil pizzas, but I know someone who can. It's hero time! More arms means more eating. This is epic. I'm in pizza heaven. You're not supposed to be enjoying this. Ugh, yuck. Pineapple. You thought that was easy? Take this. Can't eat another slice. Need a bigger stomach. It's hero time. Aha, that's more like it. Now it's time to put all these pizza slices into my belly. I'm not sure what's gonna happen when I change back into normal, but right now, I don't care. Pizza party! Oh, that's disgusting. Will you stop eating my army? My compliments to the chef. You may have defeated my cheese minions this time, but I'll be back for you, Ben Tennyson. Wait, you can't leave yet. What about dessert? Oh, get off me, you giant bowling ball. No way, not until you've made me another course. Thanks, Hex. I would have never been able to beat my record without you. 100 slices! Steam Smythe, my good man, you're a genius. Once my scorpion stinger is done, I'll finally be able to defeat Ben 10 once and for all. Things have been way too quiet around here lately. Steam Smythe must be up to no good. I know. I'll sneak into his lab so I can spy on him. <laughs> Almost done. That Ben Tem won't know what hit him. Quiet as a spider. Let's see if I can get closer and look at what old Smythe is up to. Oh no, the Omnitrix has timed out. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Well, well, well. Ben 10. What a nice surprise. I just finished my best contraption yet, and I had no one to test it out on. But now you're here, how nice of you to drop in. That's one nasty looking needle, Smythe. I didn't know you liked sewing. 
You must have some really big holes in your pyjamas. Your silly jinx won't help you now, Ben. My scorpion stinger will make sure you get the point. Scorpion stinger? You look more like a jiggly jellyfish to me. Don't worry, Ben. This won't hurt a bit. Well, it will once I poke you with it. Yes, we're back in business. Time for Steam Smice to get a taste of his own medicine. It's hero time! This thing is pretty cool. Let's try it out. Ah! 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 Quit poking me, you stupid piece of junk. Ouch! My hiney! Ha! Now I know why you spend so much time making all these silly gadgets and gizmos. They're so much fun! Ah! Job Smythe, your scorpion stinger is perfect at poking. Keep that horrible thing away from me. I think someone spent too much time indoors playing with their toys. Let's go get you some fresh air. Well, I'm glad we spent some time together, Smythe. I was starting to think you didn't like me. <laughs> Oh man, I'm so bored. I've been sitting here all day and nothing interesting has happened. Whoever told me they saw a hex around here was crazy. Ugh, where is my staff? Can't find anything in this gross, stinky jungle. Every branch looks like a staff. Ugh, stupid stick. I'm gonna snap you into a million pieces. Oh. There you are. Oh, how I've missed you. I'm sorry I said I was going to snap you into a million pieces. I would never hurt you, staff. I'm sure I can just close my eyes for a few seconds. Go! What was that? That must be where Hex is hiding. Let's do this. Hey, dude. How is it going? Are you the guy who was firing magic into the sky? Ah, oh, Ben 10. So nice of you to join me. And what perfect timing. Let me introduce you to my staff. Wow, these plants have a powerful punch. Well, you know what they say. If you can't beat them, join them. It's hero time! You shouldn't leave your stuff lying around in this jungle. Things can get lost very easily. You will never break through my vine wall in time to save your precious rust bucket. Are you kidding me, dude? These plants are my buds. Hey, my ride. You're gonna pay for that hex. I just got it clean. <laughs> it's filling up with water. Soon it will rust and it will really be a rust bucket. Catch you later. Not so fast, Hex. Vines, a little help here? Oh, oh, oh. Put me down, you creepy vines. Hang on, Hex, watch this. Better luck next time, Hex. That's what you get for messing with the green team. I'll get you next time, you little brat. Mark my words.